Web. Well, I'm getting ready to head over to Rossville here very shortly at the high school. We've got the FFA pork chop dinner tonight, so I'm going to go to that. So if you're hungry, you might want to head to that. Uh, certainly a really great cause. I was an FFA growing up and uh, certainly support that. But Live Doppler 18 is clear. It should be a nice evening to head over there to Rossville to the high school at the ag shop there. There's our little Alberta clipper moving off to the southeast now. Any shower action has moved away, but the low clouds are pivoting in from northern Illinois. So it will be a mostly cloudy night tonight. Pretty brisk winds out of the northwest. Temps falling into the mid-30s. Good news is that by tomorrow morning, a lot of the cloudiness will be eroding away off to the east, and we should enjoy a mostly sunny afternoon. A little brisk, slightly cool, but not too bad with highs about 50 to 55 degrees before some high and mid-level clouds arrive after a clear evening. Late tomorrow night into early Friday morning, you can see some of the cloudiness out here. Those will arrive. That is the warm front, and it is that warm front that could bring near record warm temperatures by Monday. But in the meantime, a nice dry Thursday, breezy to dry out the fields. Another good harvest day, 52. Another great harvest day on Friday, near 60 degrees. Boy, just an absolutely beautiful weekend. Enjoy this weekend. It's going to be the last really nice weekend for a long time. 63 on Saturday, pushing 70 on Sunday. The fly in the ointment is a tropical system. Uh, Ida has just formed near uh, the Yucatan Peninsula and is forecast to move due north. Could affect the Gulf Coast as a tropical storm, maybe a Cat 1 hurricane. But bottom line is... Uh, there's a lot of tropical moisture that is now prog to move to the north. So Monday, we're okay. Skies will turn partly cloudy near record warm at 72. The problem is Ida may get pulled up into this area of low pressure here over Iowa. And if that does happen, it's going to really up our rainfall totals. Last night, I was thinking third, half an inch maybe as we get towards Tuesday. If Ida can get pulled up into this, we may be looking at one to two inches of soaking rainfall. That bears watching going to keep an eye on it, but still warm on Tuesday before it uh, starts to really cool off towards the middle part of next week. So mostly cloudy time, becoming mostly cloudy, that is. Down to 35, 52 tomorrow, mostly sunny day, a little cool, pretty brisk northwest winds. Uh, near 60 on Friday, pretty nice day, really. 63 Saturday, 68 on Sunday, and 72 Monday, but showers and thunderstorms arrive, especially later on Tuesday before they pull out of here early on Wednesday and the temperature falls back into the mid to upper 40s. So uh, a really nice uh, period of weather is on the way. You know, we're talking near 70.